Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up uploading data from the Pipedrive CRM system to SendGrid. This is necessary in order to automatically transfer new deals from Pipedrive to other systems. For example, in SendGrid to add new contacts, each time a new transaction is added to Pipedrive, it is convenient to store, process and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, you need to select the Pipedrive data source system. Then you need to select an action get new deals. At this point you need to connect your Pipedrive account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you must specify the domain and API key. In order to get this data, you need to go to your Pipedrive account. Now you need to copy the domain from the address bar. Please note that the domain must be copied without additional characters. Next, return to the Apex Drive service and paste the domain in the required field. Now you need to specify the API key, for this go to Pipedrive. Next, in the Personal Preferences section, go to the item, API. Copy the API key and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive service. When the required fields are filled, click Save. When the connected login is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. In this case, there are no additional settings, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. At this stage, you see test data for your transaction from Pipedrive, if everything suits you, click Next. This completes the Pipedrive data source configuration. Now you need to proceed to the data ingestion configuration. Select SendGrid as the data receiving system. Next, you need to select an action, Add Contacts. At this stage, you need to connect your SendGrid account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you need to specify the API key. To get it, go to your personal account SendGrid. Then go to the settings on the tab, API Keys. If you have not yet created an API key, click, Create API Key. In this window you need to give a name for the API Key. Give full access and click Create. Copy the API key and paste it into the corresponding field in the Apex Drive system. When the required field is filled click Save. When the connected account is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. At this stage, you need to select a list to which data will be transferred from Pipedrive. Next, you need to fill in the fields with variables from Pipedrive. In order to assign a variable, click on the field to which you need to transfer data and select the required variable from the drop-down list. When all the necessary data is assigned, click Continue. At this stage, we see the test data that will be sent to SendGrid. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to SendGrid.
If everything suits you, we return to the Apex Drive service and continue the configuration. On this, the data reception setup has been successfully completed, now you need to enable auto-update. Select the communication interval, for example once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.